all welcome back to your new tutorial in a previous tutorial we have covered graphical user interface design using PyQt5 so we have used Qt designer to design graphical user interface and uh, we did exactly the same what we are having our current application so now this is the time to start coding into the Python so here we will start coding uh, into a sublime text web you do not have sublime text view you can download it from the internet so this is very beautiful free tool you which you can uh, use for you as text editor so here this is kind of a C++ coding where we will be you know giving a reference we will be getting a reference of our design and then we will be updating and getting information from this graphical user interface so first of all that we need to save this file so let's save it and uh, let's save it to the same place inside the YouTube and the tutorial and uh, let's give its name as a PyQt1 dot uh, py okay PyQt1 dot py so the first of all we need to import import sys that's the system file and then we need to get a uh, PyQt slot from from PyQt5 sorry from PyQt5 dot Qt core and then import PyQt slot okay and then we need to get Q application and Q main window from PyQt5 dot Qt widgets okay Qt widgets and then we need to import Q application and then Q main window and then also we need to import load UI from PyQt5 dot UIC and then import load UI okay great now we need to create a class and uh, let's give a name to this class as a tutorial let's say okay tutorial and uh, I think that's all oh sorry and then finally in the object uh, we need to give here Q main window since we are referring to this Q main window that is the Qt main window and uh, if you come here you will see uh, let's close this preview and you see here the main window the reference is Q main window so that's what we are coding there okay Q main window okay great so here tutorial self and then in it load UI now we need to um, give here load UI however we are not uh, uh, passing any argument so we can remove that argument and also we can remove this line okay now we can load UI and the UI name now you need to give here UI, U, UI name that's the YouTube dot UI okay dot UI and of course we need to Put it inside inside a single quote or double quote whatever you can put and then self self will refer that in this window okay it's the same reference and then finally what we need to do we need to um, we, we need to initialize this app so the app is equal to Q application and then sys dot org however um, we are not initializing any argument and then widget and we can get widget is equal to tutorial okay perfect and then widget dot so otherwise it will not so 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 will so once it is so and you cancel it it will exit okay so sys dot exit 
and inside that exit we need to exit from this app okay exec underscore perfect now let's save it so once you save it and now we need to run it so we can run it uh, we can run it by going into that window so let's go into the window uh, sorry uh, go go into the windows explorer where it is placed so it is placed here inside this complete uh, youtube and here tutorial so here PyQt1 so you need to press a shift and the right click it will automatically open this powershell window if you are working into the mac or the linux then you need to um, navigate into the folder where you have saved your pyqt one pi and youtube.ui pi and here now you need to write here the python my i'm using default python python 3.6 python then pyqt1.py just wait for a few seconds perfect now this is amazing now you see here okay if you see here it has a uh, executed this from here uh, from, from the um, Python code earlier we were saying as a preview you see there there was a preview if you see here so there was a preview okay let me press here control R see main window preview Qt designer but now we are seeing there uh, you know now we are seeing their actual window how, how, how I can see that window here see this is the actual window main window and here the main window is the name uh, the title name I'll change this title name and one more thing you can notice here this is not changed here okay this, you know this is why because we have not saved it yet and uh, you can identify this because of this star and if there is a star that means you have not saved your UI file so you can go into file and uh, then you can save it uh, that file is not coming then you can just press ctrl and s now it is saved and now you can press here ctrl into the main window so once you are into the main window then um, uh, we can give a title here okay so here is the main window okay so we can see here welcome to kgp talkie okay perfect now we need to save it control and s now let's run it once again and uh, before you run it once again you need we need to uh, close this window okay so once we close this window powershell will get it powershell must get it released i'm not sure why it is not releasing so for that what we can do there must be something wrong in the code let me see what is the wrong in, in, in the code so in this code uh, i think uh, everything is almost uh, uh, correct but still once i am closing that window this this should uh, uh, return this should release uh, this windows power cell no problem so if it is not releasing no problem in the later tutorial I'll show you what is the problem so you can press here control and the C it will release it okay so now let's run it once again beautiful it's amazing now you can see here welcome to KGP talkie and here this has came perfect so now you have successfully designed your graphical user interface using PyQt5 Qt designer and you have successfully run your python code and you have successfully integrated your UI file uh, in a python code in uh, from next tutorial I'll uh, start getting reference of these combo boxes and uh, text boxes so that we can update it into runtime so thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next tutorial in which I'll be covering uh, some more interesting tutorials. And please do not forget to subscribe this channel. Bye bye. Have a nice day.